Welcome back to the Red Carpet Reup. Today, we're diving into an intense moment from the Breakfast Club interview with Atlanta rapper Young Dro, where things almost got violent after an unfortunate misunderstanding. Dro, who's been very open about his sobriety, was joined by T.I., but a tense exchange with a friend in the room nearly derailed the conversation. Let's break down what happened and how things took a sharp turn. Young Dro has been candid about his struggles with addiction. During the Breakfast Club interview, Dro opened up about his recovery journey, discussing the challenges he's faced and how he's been sober for over 17 months. He even shared a deeply personal story about a near overdose, which coincided with his daughter's drug issues. A really heavy moment, right? While Dro was speaking from the heart, a member of their entourage sitting on a couch behind them started laughing and making jokes. At first, Dro and T.I. brushed it off, even laughing along. But the atmosphere quickly shifted when the heckler burst into laughter as Dro spoke about his daughter. That's when things got heated. Dro turned around, warned the guy pretty directly saying, you finna get slapped. He made it clear that while they were cool, laughing at something so personal wasn't going to fly. When the heckler refused to back down, saying you ain't gonna slap me, the tension went through the roof. Dro's response, what you wanna do? And at that moment, it seemed like the interview could have spiraled into something physical. Luckily, T.I. stepped in just in time to defuse the situation, reminding both men where they were and why they were there. Remember who you came in with, T.I. said in a raised voice. It was a clear call for calm and professionalism, and it worked. After the heat died down, Dro actually apologized to his friend. He admitted that he got beside himself and shouldn't have let his emotions take over. That moment shows a lot about Dro's growth, especially as he's been navigating his sobriety in an environment that's far from supportive. In fact, Dro's honesty about staying sober in the middle of a party-filled lifestyle is a major challenge for any artist in hip-hop. In a 2023 interview, he mentioned that even though he's clean, being around that hip-hop party life with all the smoking, drinking, and partying makes maintaining sobriety an uphill battle. Young Dro's Breakfast Club interview was a roller coaster. But it ultimately highlighted not just the tension, but also Dro's personal journey. From nearly losing control to apologizing and reflecting, it's clear that he's on a path of self-growth. Let me know what you think about the situation in the comments below. Was the heckler out of line? And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more updates from the Red Carpet Re-Up. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.